我最近工作多很多了，我需要部新的车，你有什么看法？你打算买什么样的车？现代的有一款索纳塔，是二零二零新款，觉得是还蛮不错的。韩国的现代，现代好像没那么好了，现在都很流行那个电车，特斯拉不错的。你也知道特斯拉？对呀、啊，电车就现在也是又环保啊，是对你来说是比较适合的。Welcome to the new MRI Production YouTube channel. This is not just another tech review. We're not talking about the price, the specs, but instead we're talking about how we feel. Are electric car ready in 2020? To be honest, I was worried. How to charge the battery, how long the battery lasts, and this is my review after half year of using it. I was really happy to learn that I didn't need to go to the dealership because I hate bargaining with a salesperson. All you need to do is take out your phone, go on the website. It's almost like buying a charging cable from Amazon. So easy, la. The Model 3 has a very unique design. To me, it looks like a toy, but in a good way. It is just so clean and minimal. The minimalism extends to the interior. My passenger always ask, Oh my god, is this an iPad? Oh my god, this is so big. <laughs> like, where's the dashboard? Everything I need is pretty much all here. Some people say, Your car is so fancy. Oh well, I don't think so. As you can see, some of the sections are not especially well made. Maybe it's Elon trying to tell me it's time to upgrade to a Model S. Driving this car does make you feel like the cool kid in high school again. I remember I was the first guy with an iPhone in 2008, and people were like, Oh my god, where's the keyboard? When every year they just come out with new innovations. The current situation of Teslas does remind me of the early days of Apples, and you do feel you're in this cool club with all the other people sharing the same experience of new technology, excitement, and then the company just gets so big and stop innovating. So let's see how long will it last for Tesla. Another stupid question. Can you get wasted and you drive to home? Well, you could always try, but you might get arrested rather than calling it self-driving. I would say it's more like giving you the time for fixing your contact lens, eating a sandwich, applying hand lotions in a safer way. The autopilot feature could be useful for road trips. Have I ever drank and drove in this Tesla? No, but sometimes when I'm tired, I do feel safer putting on the autopilot. What I like the most about driving a Tesla is how fast it is. I'm not a sport car person, but sometimes I just want that little bit of speed on the road. On your first ride, you will instantly find out how nimble the car is. It's just so different than my old Toyota Matrix. Suddenly, you become very flexible on the road. Second thing I like is the software update. It comes once a while and every time there's a little surprise here and there. You never feel old with this car. And finally, the charging situation. My main power source is the common outlet here. It looks sad, but it has been enough for me. I can always go to a supercharger for fast charging. In conclusion, driving this car is very different. It's like driving a computer. Am I happy with the purchase? Yes. Driving also becomes a fun activity. But if you can't even keep your phone charged, this is not a car for you.